Welcome to my trailer. Hey guys, I'm gonna get, give you a quick tour with my trailer. This is a bed. My parents sleep here. The couch folds down, so then this turns into a bed. My double sink, this opens up. I just can't open it up, but this opens up. Then this is a dinner table. And it turns into a bed. You just have to unfold these and then put that down and then get the covers off. This is where we keep all our candy and stuff. Over here are different drawers I don't even talk about. And then this is my bed. Now it has a kayak. Storage. Uh, we have our games, water. This is our fridge where we keep all our stuff. This is the back. This is the bathroom. We have a toilet, sink, bath, shower, soap, mirror. We got stir TV. Now you don't have to be home. You can just be here. So everybody, welcome to our home away from home. Um, this is going to be a little addition to the channel. We're still gonna be doing the jeeping, of course, but the Jeep, unfortunately, can't tow this thing. And uh, we wanted something that was a little bit more sustainable for the channel. Um, of course, with Theo being almost eight, um, we have a dog, uh, Cynthia needs to work full time. So this will be our little hub. Um, no trips planned right now using this, but we will be uh, adding some trips. When we use this trailer, we will be towing it with our Ram 1500. It's a 2015 Eco Diesel. Um, the Jeep unfortunately can't tow this because it is the six speed manual. It can only tow 4,500 pounds. This trailer weighs 4,200 pounds. So I was big on racing, so we needed this trailer for racing so we can park at the go-kart track and so then I can race. So that's why we got this trailer. No plans as of right now to be adding the racing to the channel. Um, if that is something you guys would like to see, then we can do that. But Theo has his own Instagram. It's past them all racing. racing. And yeah, you can sort of see what he's been up to on there. He hasn't raced uh, last year with everything going on. We're hoping to get him back going um, hopefully sometime this summer. But that won't affect the channel at all. So the whole plan with this trailer is we're still going to be doing the longer trips in the Jeep. But those will be when I go by myself. Uh, we'll be doing the overlanding trips in the Jeep. Pretty extreme off-road stuff. And then we're going to be doing more family trips in the trailer. Uh, with Theo and the dog and Cynthia needing to work from home. Uh, this will be a nice hub for doing all that. And while she's working... I'll be taking the RAM and doing a little bit of uh, exploring. Let's get going with the video. This is a big month for us, starting with my 40th birthday on the 3rd, then our 10 year anniversary on the 11th, Father's Day on the 20th, and Cynthia's birthday on the 27th. So we decided to go to a Soyuz and invited Sean from the story till now and his family to join us on this getaway.
having a blast today. Can't ask for anything more fun on my 40th. You know, if you're wearing goggles, you're having a good time, right? Would those be considered sea goggles? I don't know. Pilot yeah, they're goggles, sea goggles. Sure. <laughs> Pilot goggles. Look at Theo's hair, it looks fresh. Okay. If I want to see you fly, this is what you get. Handsome boy. <laughs> I'm so handsome now. All the girls are gonna like me when I get to school. Let's go! guys it's Teddy's 40th birthday today and I just wanted to give him a shout out Teddy and Cynthia were nice enough to invite me and my family to come camping with them for Teddy's 40th we're doing some catch-up shots we're getting lit happy birthday Teddy All right, everybody, here's the 40. 40. 40. Cheers, old man. Cheers, <laughs> cheers. Cheers, cheers. Okay, now try it. It was a very fun night, and I couldn't have asked for a better birthday. And thank you for everybody that sent messages, wishing me a happy 40th. Okay, let's go. Trailer's not hooked up, so I don't need the hitch. But it is a ram. And this specific ram doesn't have the fold out mirrors. So I'm gonna leave these bad boys on. Rams and their tow mirrors, right? In the morning, it got the best of us. We needed a dirt road. So we explored some of the local mountains.
So this isn't quite the off-roading vehicle as the uh, Gladiator. Putting it into four-wheel drive right now, taking the side trail. I'm not gonna explore too much because we are alone and I don't trust this vehicle out here. So really cool place. I'd like to come back with the Jeep. Let's keep going a little bit further and see what happens. dinner and by what I mean about it's not as capable as the Jeep we're talking about it's completely stock Ram 1500 on stock tires all right it's got no lift it's got nothing these are street tires I mean I'm sure with a lift and some proper tires it'd make a big difference but I use this as my tow vehicle it's on the pavement most of the time but hey it's still got four-wheel drive and it can still get us to some pretty cool places. So check this out. Cynthia made fajitas, but we had leftover pizza. So we got the pizza going. And we're gonna make fajitas. Fajitas. Fajitas? <laughs> what? <laughs> so down. So I'll start with this one maybe. Smash that. Hey. Rocky. Are we good? Mm-hmm. Okay. Take some steak. Some salsa. Some cheese. Some peppers. Some sour cream. Belly, dinner time. Go to mommy. All right. Fajita. Holy cow. Yeah. This is delicious. Until next time. Go away. Get lost. And unwind. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. If you made it to the end of this video, please do consider subscribing and hitting that thumbs up button. Also, add us on Instagram at unwinding underscore roads for some behind the scenes stuff you may enjoy and see you next week when we hit the trails with the jeep again